Hello friends, welcome back to my channel Civil Engineering Forum. We are in the introductory part of the Indian Standard Code 456-2007 under the subject Design of Reinforced Concrete Structures. Today we are going to learn a very important topic under Design of Reinforced Concrete Structures that is Characteristic Strength. So you people might have heard many a times these word Characteristic Strength. So today we will see the meaning of this word characteristic strength and uh, at first we will see the definition which says that characteristic strength means that value of the strength of the material below which not more than 5% of the test results are expected to fall. So this is basically the strength of any particular material below which not more than 5% of the test results are expected to fall. See this is a particular value and uh, below this value not more than 5% of the test results are expected to fall. That means 95% of the test results are above our expected value. And that value is known as characteristic strength. So now let us take an example. If the characteristic strength of concrete that is FCK with which it is abbreviated is taken as 25 Newton per mm square. That is the value what we are expecting. It means that here out of 100 concrete cubes tested in laboratory, more than 95% gives strength above 25 Newton per mm square. That is 5% cubes may have strength below 25 Newton per mm square. So if the 95% of the test results are above our expected value, then we can say this 25 as our characteristic strength. Where uh, FCK is characteristic strength of concrete and FY is the characteristic strength of steel. So this becomes the formula for characteristic strength that is FCK is equal to FM minus K into S. Now FCK is the characteristic strength, FM is the target mean strength, K is the risk factor and S is standard deviation. See here we have mentioned the value of K that is risk factor as 1.64. So from where did this 1.64 came and what will be the standard deviation target mean strength will find out. See we are having this formula FCK is equal to FM minus K into S where S is the standard deviation. Now what will be the value of standard deviation that will find out at first. So this is dependent on the Indian Standard Code 456-2000, the table which is given on page number 23 and the table number is 8, where uh, there are two columns, one is grade of concrete and another is assumed standard deviation. So if the grade of concrete is M10 to M15, then our standard deviation will be 3.5. If it is uh, M20, M25, then it will be taken as 4. And uh, if uh, the grade of concrete is M30 to M50, it will be taken as 5. So now we are clear with uh, the standard deviation. Now we'll talk about risk factor. That is K. So for K, we can refer this uh, table where uh, there are two columns where the first column shows uh, percentage defectives and the another column shows risk factor that is K. So Percentage defective that is uh, as per our definition 95% of the test results uh, should be positive that means 5% are test results are failing so we need to consider this row second row but if uh, there are 10% defectives then uh, we will consider this 10% first row then our risk factor would be 1.28 if it is 2.5% then it would be 1.96 and if the number of defectives are about 1% then the risk factor will be 2.33 but at present we have considered our characteristic strength and its definition with 5% effective so we have taken the value of risk factor as 1.64 and according to Indian standard design we will be taking this 1.64 so friends this is all for today and thank you for watching